Hi Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea and this reading for those of you in separation and not in communication with your person right now, we're going to find out how do they feel about you. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 20th of May 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 7.47pm. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. If you were to finally get it to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Okay, now let's get a reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. In separation right now, how does the person feel about them? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person. Page of Cups, reverse and reverse at the bottom of the deck. Justice. The strength. They're trying to be strong. Um, they're trying to be strong to not return okay so it feels like they're trying to you know with the seven of wands like okay i'm determined i'm going to focus on myself i'm gonna hold back the strength here i'm gonna hold back from returning and king of cups here is in my verse and the four of pentacles in my verse yeah you know the thing is they really <laughs> they actually feel weak but they're trying to be strong because the Four of Pentacles in Reverse feels like they might at any time, they know that about themselves, right? These Pentacles, when it's in Reverse, it falls falls down. I mean, it's like they, they're going to lose, they're going to lose the grip of these Pentacles. So they're trying to like basically be strong and hold on to it because these two are the combination, right? So... They feel like they gotta be strong no matter what, um, and try to focus on them, on themselves, on their work, and try to forget about you, um, because the three of wands here. It feels like they're looking into the future, thinking about the future, and with the justice here, they think you know the separation is called for like it had to happen like it's important right but the king of cups in reverse indicates them feeling vulnerable right now they are sad because the king of cups in reverse but they're trying to ignore their feelings because sometimes king of cups in reverse also can indicate unemotional no emotions but i feel like it's not because that they don't love you they don't care about you i just feel like they are protecting something it could be protecting their future protecting something they could be working on right now that they are prioritizing instead of you hmm. and the world here it's them feeling as though you know i need to do the best that i can to close this chapter and start a new chapter it's too important with the justice here i need to be serious i cannot drop the ball with the four of pentacles in my first so it's them feeling like they cannot lose, they cannot let go of their pride. They cannot swallow their pride because they truly believe as though this needs to happen. This separation needs to happen, right? Unless they feel like this is you feeling this way about them, like you are headstrong, um, you have something else that you're focusing on, right? And the justice here, and you're serious about not being with them, separated from being separated from them. They could also be feeling as though you don't love them, you don't care about them, and you don't have any emotions. It's almost like the logic or whatever else that you believe in that doesn't align with this connection or situation is more important. than being in a relationship with them again please bear in mind that it could go vice versa you should know where you stand in this storyline they feel like you're determined to like close this chapter 
but they're still kind of stuck. So, you know, six of swords and more, it's like they want to return. They want to return for sure. This is a stuck energy, but again, seven of wands, it just feels like no. It's like them saying, no, I must do the best that I can to close this chapter. I must. It's important for me. It's important for my ego. It's important for my work. It's important for my future. It's important that I be strong. It could also, again, go vice versa, yeah? Please bear that in mind. I'm going to pull out more cards here. But they're sad, right? Five of Cups. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Death here in reverse. Unless, again, roles are being reversed here, but Death in reverse, they're really sad. They, it's To them, it's not over yet, okay? It's them just trying to hang in there, them trying to move on. But the Nine of Pentacles is right here. So, okay, your person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Aquarius, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Libra, Leo. Can be any fixed signs. Again, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Can be any sign. But they are sad, very disappointed. But it feels like, again, it's like I need to be serious about walking away. I need to forget about Jim Libra, and Aquarius. Although... They still haven't forgotten you yet, okay? And the star here, Marvis, indicates that I'm going through healing and recovery right now, but they haven't rec uh, recovered yet. They're devastated because either the Nine of Pentacles, like, see, there's something else. Sorry about that. There's something else that they could be... One second, please. There's something else that they feel you could be prioritizing or it could be them prioritizing. You know, the thing is, the Nine of Pentacles is a very, very committed, very loyal, realistic knight. They feel like, I got to be realistic here, right? I don't want, I don't want to hope for something that I feel um, is not going to last. I keep getting this energy. It's like their priority is either their career or something that they they think it's not that they said it's more important. It's like just being really realistic. Like this has to be done. So, but they do miss you. And the Three of Cups here does look like they could be feeling like they want to see you again, but they're stopping themselves from doing that. They could also be longing for you. But Eight of Pentacles focusing on their work so they they don't get stuck in this uh, position where they're constantly longing for you. It's like, again, they're blocking, right? Seven of Wands blocking themselves, stopping themselves from missing you or thinking about you. They somehow feel responsible about... It's like... <sighs> they feel responsible for this ending. Like... But then they also at the same time feel that it needs to be done unless it's vice versa here, okay? Some of you, they may feel like, okay, maybe you don't care about them. Maybe you're emotionally unavailable for them. And they think this is the right move. And it is to end this connection, ten of swords, and to try and walk away. Unless it's them ignoring the emotions and f prioritize something else. You know, for some of you, the work handicap maybe because of distance issues or marriage, someone could be married, justice can indicate that, or because of legal issues, because of money, career issues, or both of you are just very different from each other with the strength here, the lion and the angel, both are definitely a different, different thing, right? Different species. <laughs> Hmm. I sense them that uh, do miss, like having good time, having a good time with you. Three of Cups socializing with you. They're sad. They are sad for sure. With the Five of Cups right here, they're sad. Both of you are not really talking to each other, or, or if there there is any conversation between two of you, there's this defensiveness or very guarded kind of energy. They may be feeling like you're keeping away from them as well. Again, it could go vice versa, right? And that they could be looking forward towards, you know, working on this connection. The Knight of Pentacles, maybe they feel like they need to move slowly. 
until the world and until um until this how do you say mm, until this blow over it's like it could be waiting as well because of that pentacles and the three of wands like let's wait and see what happens next when it's the right when it's the right time and it also feels like this right if we are meant to be each other be with each other we're meant to be with each other so this energy where they feel like hey in the future if we're gonna come back and reconcile with the three of cups then we will it feels like this person may believe in also like spirituality or a universe and unless that to you again it could go vice versa all right gemini libra and aquarius is your reading Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. Um, it's a tarot. No, it's not a tarot channel. It's a travel channel. <laughs> I do show my face on that channel, but not on this channel. Except for one, for one, one video where um, it was just a promo video and I posted it a long time ago. Um, I had to kind of show my face, but other than that, I don't. But if you're curious, you want to find out, go check out my travel channel <laughs> because somebody mentioned it. Why don't you show your face on your tarot reading? But anyway, um, this is your reading. I hope to see you back here again um, sooner or later. Okay, bye.